Hey folks, welcome back to another video. In this video, we will gonna talk about how you can unbreak your Redmi 9A. So this is my Redmi 9A, and you can see that it's completely bricked. I don't have any recovery option. I don't have any fast boot. So how you can fix it uh, at your own and in five minutes? Let's see it. So you will need a PC and some files to install it. So all the files are in the description. You have to download it. First is Unbreak Blossom file. Second is Python, and the third is the fast boot ROM that we are going to install in your phone. So you have to make sure that you are downloading your own uh, device fast boot ROM. And I have extracted it. Please extract it. You have to extract it. Okay. Now we are going to extract the Unbreak Blossom file. So let's quickly extract it. So the file has been extracted now. Let's open it, and we have to install some files from it. And you can install Python from here also. Just click on this Python file and double click, so it will start uh, installing. Now go to Vcom, go to Android, and here you will see a Android Wins USB file. Just right click on it and click on Install. It will install in just a second. Now back. Now you will see CDC folder here. Go to CDC, and you will see again this CDC file, which is system information file. Now again, click on it and install it. Okay, after installing it, just go back, and again go back, and you will see a USB DK folder here. Open it, and you will see an install file, which is a batch file. Just double click it, and it will start installing some drivers in your PC. Okay, I have already installed, so I am not installing it. After that, we have to install Python. So let's start. Don't forget to click add python.exe to path. It's important. Now just click on install. Python has installed successfully. Now again go to your Unbreak folder. Now go to your auth folder. Here you will see a run file. Now please stay connected with the internet connection because when you will open it, it will start running some commands or it will download some files. I am opening it. It's not showing in my PC. It's because I have already opened it. After downloading those files, it will say waiting for device. Now we have to connect our device in Chrome mode so that we can make a connection with our PC. So take your device, hold the volume up button of this, and plug it with the USB cable. When you will plug it with the USB cable, it will start running some command in your PC, as you can see, and it says protection disabled. It's very important. It should say protection disabled. If it's not says protection disabled, then please try again. Unplug your device and again open the run file and plug your device in Bro mode. Okay, so as you can see, it has been done. So now you can cross this folder. Now go back, go to SP Flash Tool folder and open this Flash Tool that you can see over here in green icon. After opening it, you have to go to Download Agent option and click on Choose. And here you will see DA6765 something like file. You have to select that file and click open. It's a download agent file. Now go to scatter loading file. Click choose. Now you have to go to your fast boot uh, folder where you have extracted your fast boot room and select this MT67 something file, scatter file. And it will load all the files that we are going to flash. Now go to option. And here you can see connection, click on it. And after con clicking connection, you have to go to your device manager, open the device manager. And go to ports. Now see MediaTek USB port. We have to remember the number of it. So it's COM4. Okay. Now cross it, select COM4 here. Whichever number it says in your device, you can select that. Now in baud rate, select the highest. Now cross it and click download it will start flashing all the files in your device and you have successfully unbricked your device after it gets done i will show my device
As you can see, it says download OK. That means flash has been done. Now let's try to start our device. So as you can see that the device has started successfully and we have unbricked our device. So this is how you can unbrick your device in just 5 minutes and it's so easy. Anyone can do it. Hope this video will help you and make sure you like this video and subscribe to the channel if you think that it is a valuable video for you. Thanks for watching.